What is going on everybody? Happy July 4th. Uh, I'm not wearing red, white, or blue, but I'm wearing uh, green, like camo, I don't know. This red fanny pack counts. That counts as being patriotic, I'd say. Every July 4th, I feel like I kind of do some crazy stuff, but I haven't posted it. Three years ago, I did a donut in my BRZ and some fireworks in the background. It's pretty dull, I'm playing the clip right now. And I'd say about two years ago, we celebrated at Jarvis's house and we had like a Roman candle war. And I think Victor, my brother, hit somebody with it. It was so funny, but I'm playing the clip right now. <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh my god! Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> but today, we're just gonna keep driving up north and see what we're up to and just get some dope shots and have fun. No way, they win. Rock, paper, scissors. Did you win? No, I didn't win. Uh -huh. Alright, so instead of driving north, we kind of drove west and now we're in Ocean Shores. We're eating at this place, I believe it's called Moby Dick. Or it's called Sand Castle. Like they didn't make up their mind, and they had two names. So we're eating here. I got fish and chips. Me and Angel's dad got fish and chips. Everyone else got surf. Was it a burger? Surf burger. Surf burger. Okay. About to eat that, and then we're about to go hopefully to the ocean. And I'm gonna fly my drone. Oh, and crazy thing about this place, Ocean Shores. I've been here a super long time ago in eighth grade for marching band. So seeing this go kart place over. <laughs> just kidding. Nerd, wow. So everyone in the comments who no, had kidding. band is gonna roast her now. No, because I was in orchestra, so. Nerd. That's, <laughs> that's a difference. No, I'm just kidding. But uh, this go-kart place I've been here like since I've been here in eighth grade. So it brings back memories. Yeah, so I've never physically been over to the water over here, but it looks exactly like Galveston in my opinion. So today is July 4th and it marks a pretty significant day in my life. Um, man, it's been about seven years now since the big day happened. So back then, me and my family used to live in Washington, all five of us, my dad, my mom, me, and my two siblings. Then some family problems happened. Can't go much into detail because, you know, it's kind of personal, but my mom took me, my brother and sister, and we went to Texas and we moved there. All by ourselves, my mom didn't have no jobs, no experience, no nothing, so first of all, I wanna shout out to my mom. My mom took a lot of sacrifice to get us where we are right now, and I, man, can't thank her and love her so much for that. And shout out to my two siblings for holding it down. Like, my family compared to other people were a lot closer, and I'm, and I'm blessed for that, so I thank God every day for that, but today's a pretty significant day for me and my family. Not only is it July 4th, you know, Independence Day, but it's the day that changed our life for the better. Uh oh, it dropped and it was shooting at those people over there. They're mad. See, that's why you can't give fireworks to kids. They did not know how to do nothing.
earlier when we were helping that person with their car, everyone passed by us with like Jeeps, trucks, did not offer help at all, not even one person. But people who didn't have those cars were coming out, putting a hand in, and that goes to show that people suck. Do you agree? Yeah. People suck. All right. And they're saying, saying like unnecessary things to the girl. I don't know. Yeah, they're saying unnecessary things like, oh, should have got a four wheel drive. Like, bro, it's a Mustang. But yeah, that pissed me off, but glad we got it out. All right. See you on the next vlog.